Long ago, a genius was born. He painted many great things, including beautiful women and the ugly tragedies of humanity. His name was Leonardo da Vinci. Not His name was Fernando Botero. In 1944, Botero attended a Jesuit school. Two years later, Botero's uncle sent him to a school for matadors. Okay class, this is How to Be a Matador 101. Who wants to go first? Yeah, that's a little slow. Just take this horn and this cape and then you are set. <laughs> Release the beast. <laughs> Fernando Botero Angulo was born on April 19th, 1932 in Colombia and is currently 80 years old. This is the most recent photo of Fernando Botero, and this is the photo of his wife, Gloria, and three children, Lena, Fernando Jr., and Juan Carlos. In 1964, Botero began living with Cecilia Zambrano. They had a son, Pedro, born in 1974, and separated in 1975. <laughs> Daddy! Daddy, where's Bob? Yeah! What's the seatbelt? Yeah! No. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, what was that? Daddy! In 1979, due to a tragic car accident, Fernando's son Pedro was killed, and he himself suffered heavy injuries. Fernando Botero typically paints portraits or situational portraits. His paintings and sculptures are all similar because they usually depict, uh, somewhat obese people. Um, the critics sensitively refer to these as large people and Botero explains them in the following way. An artist is attracted to certain kinds of form without knowing why. You adopt a position intuitively, only later do you attempt to rationalize or even justify it. He usually paints abstract, choosing colors, shapes, and proportions based on <laughs> intuitive Intuitive aesthetic thinking. In 2004, Botero exhibited 27 drawings and 23 paintings dealing with Colombian violence. He donated the works to the National Museum of Colombia, where they were first exhibited. In 2005, Botero gained much attention for his Abu Ghraib series, which were exhibited first in Europe. He based the works on reports of United States forces abuses of prisoners at Abu Ghraib prison during the Iraq war. The series was exhibited at two United States locations in 2007, including Washington, D.C. Botero refused to sell any of his works, but would donate them to museums. After, in 2006, after having focused exclusively on the Abu Ghraib series for over 14 months, he returned to the themes of his early life, such as family and Woo! maternity, in his Une Familie, I think the Botero represented the Colombian family, a subject often painted in the 70s and 80s. In 2008, he exhibited the works of his The Circus Collection, featuring 20 works in oil and watercolor. In 2010, Botero said that he was ready for other subjects. After all this, I will always return to the simplest things, still lifes, Botero said. Due to the graphic nature of this portion of the film, viewer discretion is advised. The following audio was completely improvised. Well, you see, this is clearly a painting of Adam and Eve in the garden. Yeah, you can you can even see the snake snake there slithering right. out of the tree. A very wise observation. Mm. 
No, 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 not the um the curvature of the the subjects' bodies <laughs> in the painting. Very accurate to the time period. <laughs> yes, indeed, indeed, yep. I believe so. I agree with you, Master. Lord. The first sin of trying to cop a feel. Uh, now that is just clearly <laughs> a big head. I that, mean, no, it's it's a parody yeah, of, of an actual painting. One flat nose. <laughs> no, it's it's a parody of an actual painting. It's called After Pietro della Francesco, and the ri- the original version is Pietro della Francesco. Is that loaf? Is that a butt chin? <laughs> <laughs> is that a butt chin? Okay, this um, this is a painting <laughs> depicting <laughs> this guy has clearly been raped. It's it's a it's a painting. <laughs> it's a it's a painting. Depicting his face. Let's take it down here. We're still he, recording. He has clearly taken the. <laughs> <laughs> it is depicting the violent um, torture of uh, the prisoners at uh, Abu Ghraib prison. Uh, I don't know what about this painting makes you say violent. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's, it's very bloody. He's it's bleeding out of his b- I mean, look at that. The use of oil <laughs> painting. Oh it, really, <laughs> it really brings out the violence. The cruelty is evident in the man's face. We don't have to cut out like all No, the, 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 Shut up, Mike! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, the, the, these series of paintings were gained in worldwide notoriety in the uh, art world. Okay, this next <laughs> one is... <laughs> that is... That is something. This, ne- this <laughs> next painting is a painting of... <laughs> no, no, I don't think it's Botero's wife. <laughs> All right, well, um, look at that boomerang. It's, it's called it's called Botero Nudo. <laughs> <laughs> so well, clearly he's in the pornography business. <laughs> uh, <laughs> All right, well, I can't really find any facts about this. I mean, so. look at that boomerang. It's just curvy. Oh man, I didn't. <laughs> oh. I didn't even see it. She looked like a boomerang. I mean, oh, what the? I didn't even see it, Jeezy. I didn't hear it. Why are you holding a boomerang? It's, it's not a boomerang. It's part of the bed. That's a boomerang. Oh yeah, it's part of the bed. <laughs> <laughs> the boomerang. All right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is most likely the same woman. So dancing. It's called. It's called Ballerina Nabarra. Um, it, it's a painting by Botero. Most of his paintings are oil paintings. Uh, most of them are paintings of fat people, too. <laughs> They're all blown up. Fat naked people. <laughs> <laughs> bar. Okay, it means ba- ballerina bar. Ballerina bar. On a bar. Oh, she's on a bar. See, she's yeah, yeah. on a bar. <laughs> yeah, okay. Indeed. Perfect. I, I don't know if the bar is going to be able to hold out much longer, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Okay. Uh, um, you went, why'd you go back? Oh crap! Yeah, I went back. Okay. Okay. This He's is. He's clearly trying to pull a matrix here. No, that's a painting of Pablo Escobar, uh, a drug lord who who. The crackhead. Yeah, it was a crackhead. He, he was. He, he clearly he, didn't do the matrix shot. right because yeah, he know. got shot in the he head. He didn't bend over <laughs> far yeah, enough. He, yeah, he did. He did go back far. No, enough. this this is a this is a painting of a real event though. Pablo Escobar tried to escape on a rooftop. And, uh, yeah, he, he clearly got lit up. I mean, look at all those bullets. Yeah. There's not actually a book about it. Not a very bright day. Yeah, okay. Okay, this That is clearly <laughs> a green man on the cross. Okay, this, we, this, this is a topic of debate. Is it the Statue of Liberty or not? That, it's that a Statue is of Liberty. It is a okay, Inri, Inri, the note Inri means King of the Jews. So, there's a city in the background... In New York City, seeing as, you know, that's the building. Yeah, we don't, yeah, we don't. Yeah, he's green, though. Yeah, he's green. I don't that's, get that. that. That's why he's, he's green, and Liberty. he's in front of New York are the only arguments for Statue of Liberty. It's a guy, though. Yeah, so he, he <laughs> changed things a little. So, okay, so okay, so alright. It's, it's, a, it's a Jesus, green Jesus. Okay. That is uh, clearly some lady who just got out of the shower. Um, I don't know what makes you say that. All She's right. dry. She looks similar to the ballerina, so it might be his wife. Uh, there's no yeah. title on the painting. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I was looking at the title, okay? I was, I, I was zooming in on the title. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, we were forced to censor this photo for graphic nudity. <laughs> um, and all the other ones, too. Yeah, the, w- yeah a little censoring. Okay. Okay, this is a painting of uh, from a series called The Circus by Fernando Botero. That monkey's fat. It's smoking a <laughs> b- 
I don't know if you've ever oh seen it. Dude, look at the book. It's, it's, a, it's a cigarette. <laughs> it's, clearly, it's clearly a cigarette. I um, think that's I'm not sure if the woman or the elephant would weigh more. <laughs> <laughs> okay. From the okay. Um, this one's called Demon. D- Demon. Is uh, this called Demon? Yeah. Why? So There's an angel there, too. Mm, no, looks they, like a demon to me. Yeah, they, the angel has horns. <laughs> he oh. has bunny ears. <laughs> <laughs> That's a long candle, don't you say? Oh. Maybe it's not. <laughs> That's like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not a candle. That's definitely a candle. Is he holding a Bible? N- yeah. Is it a Bible? That's a, no, no, on the other <laughs> hand. Okay. Probably a Bible. I think we can agree it's a sailor. Yeah, he's a sailor boy. Boy. So wh- wh- where do the demons come into this? Um, he, They were obviously trying to get him to do something bad with that fire. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah mo- the, the majority of his paintings are, po- are political. Uh, Things. And naked. Looks like he's staying on the path. Surprised he's not naked here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I have no clue what this is. It's just a midget lady. He has one. Uh, well, the, face. The, the painting is called Ladies. Ladies? There's only one lady. Maybe the fox is a lady. Oh, that's true. <laughs> Let's <Wait>. check. <laughs> <laughs> Sh- oh, okay, okay, we have to censor all of this. <laughs> you, know, you know how much you're gonna have to edit out of this? Yeah, I know. I'm gonna have to sit through <laughs> listening to all this again. <laughs> it's seven minutes long right now. Dude, I'm, so wanna, I'm gonna want to put here this. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, he clearly okay. lost the rest right. of the match. Uh, we almost had to censor this. Almost. <laughs> uh, well, as you can clearly. He has taken several what bullet injuries. He, he, has, he, has, he has been stabbed several times. Uh, he's bleeding out of his eyes. Yeah, this is another one of the Abu Ghraib paintings. He is, um, he is, he's definitely sweating blood right now. He could ruin his whole day. It's, it's called, it's what called Abu Ghraib. It's called, Ab- I'm looking at the title in the signature, okay? It's, it's signed by Botero, and it's c- titled Abu Ghraib. It's in the Abu Ghraib series of paintings. All right. That is Napoleon. I don't think it's it is. Napoleon. That is Napoleon. not Napoleon. Napoleon didn't wear it's green. A, I think that might yeah, be like Stalin. I think no. Never mind. That's not Stalin. Okay, who wears green uniforms? America. Mexico. <laughs> Mexico. Mexicans. Mexicans. Well, this, okay, did he? Say, he didn't. I can't read the signature or the title of this painting. Um. Well, it's clear. Size one. I think it's called size one. Actually, it's called. Size